Hey, what's going on guys? How's everybody doing today? I'm doing well. Thank you for asking. Saturday morning, just getting out. 7.58 a.m. Sun's coming up. Beautiful. Nice cool morning. Even got my hoodie on. So, what has happened over the week? Well, if you kept up with the channel, you know I took an easy week. So I started off not feeling so well. And instead of trying to push myself to do something stupid, I just kind of took it easy this week. And still worked out. And that's what it's about. Just working out. I mentioned something yesterday in my video about you know we all start we all start working out for the purpose of working out well I said this kind of sort of in a roundabout way I'll put it that way you know we kind of start working out for health and fitness and to get a little stronger and all that then eventually a lot of times eventually we end up setting small goals for ourselves and then that's where the PRs come in trying to reach this goal and that goal and uh, but really it should all be about you know the working out you're not gonna hit PRs for life well, I did one more rep than I did 10 years ago. There's a PR. I mean, I guess that's a PR. But eventually the PRs die out and and if you care about the actual process of working out, you continue working out. And you don't just work out for the PRs. My goal is to be active until I die, whenever that is. My goal is to try to get a little bit healthier. My goal is to build a jump rope for a minute without feeling like I just ran full speed a mile. That's my goal. So eventually my PRs will die out. Worrying about the heavy weights dies out and you just work out. You do the hokey pokey and then you know you turn yourself around guys and uh, That's what it's all about. The hokey pokey. Hey, that sun is directly in my eyes. So, that was last week's working out. Got that over and done. And going into this new week, I'll be back to the old grind and <laughs> seeing where I go seeing what I do I do notice that I do notice that working out a little lighter though is less stressful <laughs> I do notice that 
not quite as stressful. Home screen. Unlock for a brother. Come on, there it is. There's my screen. So, on today's agenda, get my walk done, make a big old breakfast, and well, I don't know what. Maybe go for a little bike ride. I need to do some housework. Get some things done. You know, when you don't feel good sometimes, the housework don't get done quite as much. So, got some clothes to get done and some dishes to run. and Pick up a few things left over that's outside from the Halloween stuff. And not too much, but got some stuff I need to do. <sighs> Tree double A's, buddy. Tree double A's. So, what next? Other than housework. Well, I always like to take some time, if I can, and play a few minutes of my video games. I don't play too long. I play for a few minutes and then turn it off, and a little later I might play for a few minutes and turn it off. And I don't play long times like I used to. I'm too restless. I get crazy just kind of sitting there sometimes and I want to stimulate the brain and do something else. I may make some noise on the drums today. I got a a gift from one of my subscribers last chance knives a couple weeks ago new microphone and a little control unit for that and all that I need to get that looked at and figured out at some point I'm slow about things sometimes I get slow about stuff sometimes Wouldn't mind getting a short little bike ride in today. Nice as it is. I like the cooler weather. So you guys see me doing things in my videos and I see some of you guys doing things in your videos. But I got a question. What are some of your hobbies? What are some of the things that you like to do that maybe some of the viewers haven't seen 
or maybe some of us have seen and uh, some of us haven't or what are some that you just not shown us or told us about what are some hobbies and some things that you enjoy doing I'm pretty uh, I'm pretty good about showing the things that I do and uh, one thing I've always thought was weird is there's people out there that do nothing that really don't do anything to they just sit around and watch TV or maybe these days flick around on their phone and what have you but there's people out there that that don't have hobbies passion passions in life and different things they don't really do anything I've never understood that me that's kind of that's just always been a part of my life is to to do things I don't mean I'm doing great things nobody's standing back in awe going oh my god did you see what Michael did good grief that's amazing no but just doing things Whether it's collecting action figures, like I do. Or drawing, like I do sometimes. Or painting, like I do sometimes. Or photography, like I do sometimes. Or tinkering around with electronics, computers, and doing different things. Or hitting on the drums. Or... You might not know it, but I like shooting video. I like doing videos. It's not, I mean, it's a lot of work, but I guess I'm not going to call it work because I enjoy doing it. Yeah, it, it takes over my time sometimes, but that's the way it goes. I do a lot of videos. I just never, I never understood going through life and just not doing anything. I did things when I was an infant, when I was a young teenager, an older teenager, a young adult, and now that I guess since some people out there like to call me an old man, I guess I do things as an old man. I'm an old man. So. I've thought that I've thought that for years about people that really don't do anything. I mean like 30 years I've probably thought about that since I was a young a young man. What are you doing today? Nothing, just sitting around. Oh, okay, cool. Mm. I do a lot of sitting around. But I also like to enjoy stuff. One thing I don't do, and it might surprise a lot of you out there, is I'm bored and bored. <laughs> I'm born and bred a, a southern, southerner, so called country boy. But, 
I've never been hunting, never been fishing, never been camping. I don't sit outside behind, you know, by a fire roasting marshmallows and drinking a bud and smoking some bud. I've never had a good old boy truck. I don't have no hound dogs or coon dogs or any of them kind of dogs. I'm not a dog person. <laughs> so that's another thing. I'm not a, a dog person or a cat person. I don't care to really have animals. If I had to choose, I'd have a cat. A little less trouble than a dog, usually. Well, we do have a cat and a dog. It's not by my choice. But anyway, yeah, I'm not a hunter. Now, I'm not going to say I've never been fishing. I did when I was in between the ages of probably 10 and 13. A, I guess a friend. We'll call him a friend. <laughs> a friend down the road from where I lived. Uh, even further down the road from that, there was a, a overpass. A little overpass on the road there and there's a creek, 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 whatever stream that ran underneath it. Back then it was actually nice. And uh, probably two or three times I went with him down there to just, I guess, try to fish. And if you caught anything, it was about like that. <laughs> And that's literally the only fishing I've ever done was way back then. And honestly, like I said, two or three times. Mm. Now in my older age, after playing my hunting game, let me wipe the lens off. I play a hunting game. I know it's weird for someone who don't hunt and I'm not a, I guess a good old boy, good old, you know, country boy. I play a hunting game and that hunting game has made me appreciate and be kind of interested in hunting. Now I would probably try it. I think I would rather try, I think I would rather try using the bow as a gun because I feel like there's more of a challenge. I think a, a bow just kind of, I think a bow kind of evens the playing field a little bit. Let's get through this top sign. There we go. Anyway, maybe sometime I'll get the, the hankering for it and either go myself or ask some professional hunter to take me under his wings and and try it. I don't know. So again, in the comments, guys, leave some comments and uh, tell us what you like to do other than working out might be interesting to find out some other people's interests in life. <laughs> hey, what's your favorite genre of movie? What's your favorite genre of TV show and music and, you know, stuff like that? And if any of you play games, video games, what do you play? I say genre because it's hard to just say, what's your all-time favorite movie, your all-time favorite TV show, or all-time, what's your favorite song? 
that's just too difficult of a question to ask. So you can maybe do it in categories. You know, horror, comedy, sci-fi, stuff like that. Romantic comedy. Let's face it, there's one out there that everybody likes. I'll admit it. So, anyway guys, I'm just about home. Get some breakfast cooked up. And we'll see what the rest of the day uh, has in store. Trees. Beautiful trees. Well, guys, like, share, subscribe, comment. All that good stuff to the body beat down. That's me, Michael, your walking and talking host. Don't forget, get up, get out, get rad, do it to it, and we'll see you next time on the body beat down. Peace. Get up, get out, get rad, and do it to it.